Okay, guys. Obviously, there's been a lot of animosity between Stan Perry and myself over the years. And unfortunately, today, that came to a boiling point. Am I proud of what just transpired out there? No. But I'm also not about to back down to a bully. And that's what Stan Perry is. Questions? Well, you guys know I lost my ex-wife, Brandy, last week. And I asked all the players on the reins before the round started to show their support by wearing this black ribbon on their hat. And Stan refused. He said it was too distracting, which is absurd. So my blood was already boiling before we even got out to our starting hole out on 6B. Well, the gamesmanship started on our second hole, which was number seven. You know, I had just taken an X on six, so I had some serious red ass on that tee ball on seven and ended up blowing it dead right into the shit. And when we got over there, A, I couldn't believe I found my ball, and B, it was sitting on a wad of cash. Just a perfect lie. And as I'm lasering my yardage to the flag, Stan comes over and says, it's out of bounds. And I'm like, excuse me? And then Stan showed how if you lined up the white stakes, I was a good 12 to 15 feet OB. So he was hitting me with the ticky-tack rules calls basically right out of the gate. Well, Stan, it's just the drip, 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 you know, of annoying things he does that just kind of start to add up. Like every time me or my partner Kyle would get over a putt, he would say, knock it in, which, as you guys know, is just an all-time dick move because... We all know he doesn't really mean it. You know, Stan's also a big high five guy. You know, I'm a club professional. Okay. When I hit a gap wedge from the middle of the fairway to 60 feet, I'm in no mood for a high five. And Stan's been around long enough to know that. <laughs> well, the shit hit the fan there at the last. My partner, Kyle Kupchak, had a six footer to have the match. And I turned to Harmony and I said, you know, do you need to see that? And Harmony just kind of shrugged her shoulders and was all like, what do I care? And before we could pick it up, Stan runs in and overrules her and makes Kyle putt it. Then when Kyle missed, I noticed Stan give a little fist pump and that's pretty much when I lost it. Well, when Stan turned to shake Kyle's hand, I tried to sucker punch him and I missed. Then when Stan realized what was going on, he kind of wheeled around and tried to stab me with the flag, flag stick and damn near impaled me. You know, by the grace of God, it just went through my shirt. And we both ended up on the ground and luckily Harmony and Kyle were able to pull them off of me. No, I have two backups. Anything else? Okay, thanks guys.